Hi everyone, I'm Ronan Unchained. Begin Ahsoka Disney Plus. This 30 second uh, video is dropped. This show has been my highly most anticipated show of the year. There's many more that follow up, but this is it. This is the one. So let's check it out. It's been a while. Things have changed. Hey. Okay. I started hearing whispers about Thrawn's return. Oh, release date! The Jedi fell a long time ago. Where are we left? Whoa, they showed that! Perhaps it is time to begin again. Woo hoo hoo! The original series streaming August 23rd. Okay! Uh, there's some stuff I've seen that hasn't been in public yet, as of now, up, up, at least until a few hours ago when this dropped. Um. Pretty much everything in the in the this thirty second teaser, if you will, TV spot, was the exact same thing from the first teaser that was officially released to the audience to, to the world, except for there's a few shots where we see Sabine Wren light up a lightsaber and face off against uh, one of the new uh, um, dark users, the, the actress Ivana, who's playing or not uh, playing her. That was part of the footage I saw at Celebration. Yeah, it, it showed when she picked up a lightsaber, which, spoiler, 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 if you don't know, that is Ezra Bridger's lightsaber. So the, the hologram that she's looking at, Ezra, who, are, who us, the Rebel fans and family, have been waiting to find out where is he, is he okay? But it's so poetic, so sweet that she, that he left her his lightsaber and she's been, I'm assuming, training with it on the off shoot and whatnot, and now she has to put up a fight against this dark user. Um, that's unique because that was footage that only we uh, at Celebration saw, and there's some other stuff that's still hidden. Um, there's a shot of this door popping up with uh, a gas, so I could be wrong, but I could have sworn there's somebody's face on that corner of that frame where the, the, the air comes out of this ship's landing platform. I believe that's Captain Gillard Pelion, who we did see in Mandalorian Season 3, Episode 7, where it's a Shadow Council, and it's like, Grandma, Grand Admiral Thrawn's return will herald in the new age for the Empire, why not? Pelion is, is like Thrawn's right-hand man, or left-hand man, if you will, who, like, has Thrawn's back and, like, gets his orders. So that's good that they show that shot, and the only other new shot, I believe, is that Ahsoka stabbing one of those um, robotic troopers, one not droids that she faced off in the beginning of the temple, but she looks like she's in that junkyard. I don't know, uh, but it's only a few frames that are difference. But also, we finally have an official release date, which is August twenty third, which by now would be let's see, one, two, two months and two weeks away. I, I cannot wait. I cannot wait. But this is just a, a good, good time to be uh, a fan. And specifically, if you rolled with that crew like I did all those years, um, this is also special as well. In the meantime, if you bother to check this out, thank you so much. But go check out my uh, reaction to the Silk trailer. Uh, go watch the, I can't believe I did too, uh, two theory videos, if you will. I did one prior to me going to Star Wars Celebration, thinking of like what we will see, what the storm might be about, and then one right after I saw the footage and trailer of uh, during uh, my stay at London. May the Force be with you. We're getting Ezra Bridger. He's coming home.